ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Night of the Dead. I am Zystars, and today, today we are taking the vehicle out. It is finally time. We've got all the things, and indeed, we have all the stuff. I'm actually going to take all the rest of this fuel, too, because we don't need all the fuel in there. And we have inside the vehicle, which is now fully built up, the stuff for a motorcycle. We have a whole bunch of storage. We have a research bench. We have the crafting tables. We've got everything we need. This one here will let us recycle our, our weapons so that we don't run out of space. And it's going to be glorious. Hopefully this works. And we've got a little bit of a bottleneck there, but that's okay. Oh, we're down to 53 arrows. Let's make sure we have enough arrows. And then we're bringing the submachine gun with us. We shouldn't need it, but we're bringing it anyway. Um, let's see if we have arrows in here. We do not. And actually, let's just bring a full stack of SMG ammo. There we go. Just, just in case we need it. We probably won't, but just in case we do. Okay, uh, and we're taking our money for obvious reasons. Though we don't need all of this candy. I'm not sure what to do with it now that we don't really need it all that much. We've got a ton of it, but it only heals 35 hit points, so it's good for, like, little heals, I guess. I guess. Now, we are going to go do some serious looting. We're going to head over to this area here, and we're just going to loot the crap out of everything that we can. What's this? Oh, we already did that. We're just gonna we're just gonna go and we're gonna explore and loot and because really that's all we got to do now. The missions are done. Oh, and the other thing I did is I turned up. Uh, what do you call it? I turned up arrows. What am I? Ta I'm talking, so I'm losing track of what I'm doing. I turned up the number of zombies on the horde. We're gonna have max zombies on the horde. I just cranked the 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 bars all the way up to the right because why not? You know. So. Every zombie that can come... What the heck just happened to my sticks? <laughs> Every zombie that can come is going to come. And it's going to be glorious. Okay, so... 10? That's 50? That's 100? That ought to do. We probably won't need that many, but... We're going to put them in there anyway. And then we're going to... Now, we're not going to come back... You know, generally speaking, we're not gonna. Oh, <laughs> we're not gonna come back just because we're at half a tank of gas. We're not gonna come back just because it's horde night. Oh, what the hell? Oh, there we go. There we are. Okay. We are only gonna come back when we need to. So which way are we going? We're gonna go. We're gonna have to go over this mountain, which is the crappy part. Which is why we're not gonna come back. Just. On a whim with the with the the truck. Let's see what this does. Does this destroy the whole thing? It destroyed nothing. I'm stuck on a mailbox though. A mailbox is, is vexing me. There it goes. Oh, this is a weird view. Like this is really high up. This is a crazy view. Okay, let's see how much gas. I wonder how much gas it's going to take. Okay, so the best way is to go back to the left. So, yeah, let's get... I think we're too far. We hit a rock. It's going to be an interesting drive, getting this thing over. Though, we are in the upgraded version, so I'm hoping the upgraded version allows for like maybe better gas mileage maybe <laughs> i don't know <laughs> this may be just a terrible waste of resources but whatever okay we didn't blow that car up the other thing we're gonna do is take apart every car that we come across so it's gonna take a little while to get there so let's let's break i think and we'll come back when something gets interesting or we get to the other side Hello, mountainous terrain. See, can we get over this thing? That's the question. Okay. This thing doesn't seem to have any problems with the torque. Honestly, the trees are the biggest issue. 
because it's impossible for this thing to take a tree down. Which is the weirdest. Just the absolute weirdest. Okay, at least it doesn't roll. Now, can we get up this hill? Come on, baby. We're going west. Oh yeah, easy day. <laughs> this thing is not easy to drive. Like, it is super bouncy. It is definitely not designed to be going over mountains. Or through the woods, but over, over the mountains is the big one. Okay. Thread the needle, Z. Thread the needle. All right, we made it to the bay or to the the bank. Let's see what. Oh wow, look at that! It's down to twenty three. How far does this go down? I wonder. I don't think I'm going to be able to buy these for quite some time. I mean, yeah, I'll buy them for twenty three. I wonder how high they go. I wonder if I just bought them all at a ridiculously high price. I kind of want to see what's in this bank. Oh, Jesus. Wow, those guys hit hard. Alright. We got that. Let's pick that stuff up, dummy. What else is in here? So, guess what I did? I left my aluminum all at the base. So unless I find some aluminum... We're not taking the motorcycle, or the, yeah, we're not taking a motorcycle back to base. And I don't have a mask with me, so I can't go into the titanium mine. Because you, you mine, or no, you don't mine aluminum with the titanium, that's right. We'd have to go all the way to the aluminum mine, which definitely isn't going to happen. So I think we're just going to loot this place. Um, we're going to, you know, I was thinking the mall might have it, but I don't remember seeing a... Um, a metal thing in the mall. So let's uh, let's see what's in this bank. Well, let's let's go ahead and do let's kill everything. What? We'll kill everything and then we'll loot it. That way, it's a little bit less of a of cutting. Okay. There we go. Boy, that was a pain. Alright, what are you guys doing? Are you guys just gonna hang out in the door, or are you gonna come and play? Oh, Jesus. Okay. What are you doing? Actually, now that I've checked this, I would like to find a kiosk that sells the colas and get the cold resistance cola. That's what I'd like to do, and then head up into the cold zone. Kind of get a feel for what's up there. I think that'd be pretty sweet. Alright, all in all, I mean, not a bad haul. We got a thorn shield, a silencer, which is pretty cool. Um, uh, defense is the best attack. The veteran riot police, which is pretty sweet. Let's go see... Do we have that one yet? Uh, skills... Veteran. Okay, yeah, we have that one already. So we'll just dump it in the box and move on with life. Easy day. This thing's got a ton of storage, so... Oh no, it's full. Take all, baby. We're gonna need to empty it out. That is pretty sweet. Um, I think what we're gonna do now is we're gonna head up. And... Locate the mall. See if I can find the sodas that I need, and then take the road up north, go somewhere new. Here we go, into the depths of the cold zone. Now, if we bring a boat, we could dock right there, just push, well, I don't know if we could get this onto a boat, that would be pretty amazing though. It's not cold now, yeah, ooh, we're gonna need to... We need to put down a bedroll now that we're in the icy tundra. Oh, look at this guy. Okay, he died pretty easy. 
And he explodes. Of course he does. Oh, and that's one of those two-headed guys. Okay. And then let's kill you, because if I die, I don't want you to be here bothering me. Alright, and then I'll probably clear everything out here. Pretty neat little train system you got going on up there. That's cool. Put that down. I just wanted it flat so I could get in and get all the stuff I need to make a bed. Okay, so we should have the cloth in the other stuff in here. Uh, oh. Yeah, there's a bunch of dudes. Let's deal with these guys. You don't want to put your bed down where there's a bunch of dudes. Actually, this ought to be pretty good right here. Alright, so let's get a bed roll down. I just, I want to get it down before I go, go goofing around too much. Okay, revival point set. Because if I go goofing around too much and I die, I'm running all the way back. The Shining Plasma Shield. That was a weird one to pop up. Is that saying there is a plasma shield somewhere or it wants me to make it? probably wants me to make one. Which is going to be a crafting quest. Oh. Yeah. Festus Mythology. Oh yeah, the Master Blacksmith popped up, but I don't think we're going to go for that. Botanist Jack and the Beanstalk. Oh, here we go. Reforge the plasma shield. Plus four, plus ten, and parry fifty zombies. Alright, well, that's uh, something that I can do. Oh, look at that big bastard. I always forget that guy explodes. Alright, let's grab some plastic, and then I think we'll put down the motorcycle and do a quick drive around town and just see what we can see. Alright, let's go see what this town's got to offer. Okay, so we got a pretty sweet looking train station. We'll probably go into that to kind of see what all is there. See what they've put into the train station. Looks like we've got some sort of coliseum type of deal. Let's take a left and go over there. Okay, we got some vending machines, pretty much normal stuff. This stuff is all normal, there's nothing nothing unique to any of this. We got some plastics, which actually let's grab. Plastic oh! Oh you're new. Journal Combat Quest 9. Was that 9 or 19? Uh, here we go. Mine. Kill mine wear helmets. That's dumb. I've been doing mines for ages now. Alright, let's see. Okay, I'm not too impressed by that guy. He did give me a plasma shield, though. Cold resist, attack stamina usage, and durability reduce. Okay. I mean, you, you won't. I won't say no to a plasma shield. All right, what do we got here? What does that say? Um, Yehibe mat. Okay. Who knows what that is, but it's a pretty sweet little coliseum thing. I'm sure some of these are intended to be quest POIs. Okay, it looks like a mall of some sort. That's pretty cool. Oh, combat quest 20, cold breath. Okay. Combat quest 20. Okay, wants us to kill some of those big guys. I don't know if I see any more. Oh, there's a couple of ATM machines. We're going to hit those. 
I never pass up ATM machines. Alright, we got some cars. Lots of cars. I mean, lots of loot, that's for sure. Lots of places to loot, lots of zombies. So far, I'm not seeing much in the way of unique buildings. I'm sure there's something here that's unique. What is that? Was it just a white pig, I wonder? Alright, let's see. What all do we have up in this frozen tundra? Hmm. The hanger looking thing. Okay. Alright, so this town doesn't seem to offer a whole lot in the way of unique stuff. Just a bunch of zombies. Lots and lots of zombies, some cars to loot, some regular stuff to loot. Nothing, nothing earth shattering, you know? Nothing that says, hey, come loot me. I want to see what's in you, you know? Like, I'm just not seeing anything like that, except for that one building over by where the vehicle is at. All right, oop, let's do a cheeky repair. This plasma sword does seem to lose durability a lot faster than um, than other weapons. I mean, it's insanely powerful, so I'm definitely using it, but... Or maybe it's just because it swings so fast. Might be it, too. Yeah, I thought so. Is that guy completely black? Like, what's going on with that guy? Oh. Plasma long sword. Ooh, we could use that for a little bit. Do what that's about. I've never used one of those. Let's put that here. Oh, jeez, oh, Pete's. Look at this thing. Oh, I don't like how slow it is. Nah, I think part of the benefit of having a plasma sword is how fast it goes. I'll take a look at the damage here in a second. Okay, so the damage on this thing is 157 as opposed to 122 upgraded four times. So the damage is definitely there, but the um, the swing speed is like half. So for the swing, swing speed to be half and the damage not to be double, I mean, it makes it not work, not really worth it. Especially since you don't get a shield at that point. And shields are super key, you guys. They're super key. Alright, let's make that. I'm tired of looking at the thing telling me that it wants me to do that. Ooh, what do we got here? Okay, so there's the costumes. Okay. None of this is lootable. Okay, that's just metal. Break it down. Pretty sure these are just metal if I break them down. Pretty sure I just woke up the whole the whole mall. Can we get up here? Yeah. Oh, we got some ATM machines. Oh, this is where I wish I would have brought my flamethrower. See, this is how you do it if you're being responsible. <laughs> Not just YOLO in it. I do love how they actually go towards the sound. They don't immediately just come after the player, which is... That, that's pretty cool. Oh, Jesus. Got a few items there. Copper armor, iron armor, iron shoes. Oh, we got another, another run. Come on, bitches.
<laughs> gimme, gimme, gimme. Okay, so popped up with Survival Quest 12. Goal, level 70 out of 90. Oh, I got level 70. Oh, sweet. Oh, I do need the evasion rate. It wants me to have a 30% evasion rate. Okay, whatever. Alright, let's see what all we can get in here. Or at least see what we can all wake up. Got another level, which we'll worry about later. Yeah, hitting that hitting those ATM machines definitely woke up the boys. Crafting quest twenty six. Uh okay. Is that a book that I just got? I'm not sure how that one activated. Because it's not one that's on the map. We got combat quest there, combat quest there. Oh, that means there's a mine up here. Yeah, there's a mine up there. Ooh. I don't have a gas mask with me. Unless I found one and didn't notice. Alright, let's see what's... Uh, I don't think anything's in these burnt store shops. Storefronts. Oh. All right, a little bit of ammo, a little bit more ammo, hmm. bridge, I don't care about the bridges, and these have good components in them, more fridges that I don't care about, garbage cans, fridges, now let's check one fridge, yeah, it's a can of beans. Um. Oop, we definitely want to check these. What was that? Oh, an eight times scope. Not that I use the snipey do in this game, but now that I have an eight times scope, I might. I might go back home and, or when I go back home, or when I find a sniper rifle, I might put that to use. I do have a shitload of sniper ammo. Might not be a bad one to use in the board, too. Stand at one end and just pop heads, just for giggles, because I have, like, I don't know. And stacks of sniper rifle ammo back home. Okay, let's see what's in this. Okay, a couple of copper pieces. That's good. I wonder if there's tier 6 armor. That'd be interesting to know. That was uneventful. Hey, a door. That you can't go in. Alright, a couple of pieces of uh, copper armor. That doesn't suck for loot. It's not great, but it doesn't suck. That was weird. Oh, is there another floor? It might be the roof. I'll take that. Oh, I'll take the manure. Pepsi machine. Take the money. Oh, there! I see another loot box. None of these doors work. I'll definitely take the rubber. Did I come over here? Did I walk right past those machines? Uh, open. Okay. That was dumb. Alright, let's see. Okay, these are all empty. That's not. Rotten, rotten. Okay. 
bookshelf. You never pass up a bookshelf, just in case. Okay. Alright, nothing else over here. I don't think the roof is accessible. Okay, this is where we came up. Alright, I think this building is done. I don't think the roof is accessible. Alright, sweet. Well, let's go offload all this stuff, jump in the car, and head up north a little bit farther. Alright, I think probably the last thing we'll do. I was trying to get to that power station, but things keep coming up. Cool stuff keeps coming up. So I think we'll probably do the power station tomorrow. Today, like that right there, or whatever that thing is up there. Um, there's a book in, I think, this building? I think? Or a building next to it, maybe? Is this a building? Okay, I can go in here. Oh. This appears to be just a storage room, though. Okay, so... Holy crap, what the f... Holy cow, man. That was bananas. Alright, uh... Hmm. We got in there, and then we got in there. But that looks like where that guy came out. Looks like there's a coil box in there. Or a mod box. I didn't really get to look at it. Alright, we just got a couple of crates in here. Oh yeah, here we go. Excellent. That's not either of them. That's the, the loot box. Um... Well, this is just a bunch of storage rooms. Beginning to think this isn't the building on the map. Is that a zombie? No. These usually have ammo in them. Uh, it's right behind me, it says. Kind of like an underground bunker. Like, is there an underground bunker near here? Huh. Oh. Hunt birds. Oh, yeah. Is that the mine? That might be one route to a mine. I don't know what's up there. Let's see. Yeah, I don't know what that is. It kind of looks like an underground bunker. With the way it's sloped and stuff. Or like a big warehouse. But these are all just regular houses. Like, these aren't the right kind of structures. Hmm. I don't know what any of this is. Okay. So that'll have to wait, because I don't know what that structure is. So let's... screw it. Let's just keep going. Oop, I just ran into a big old clump of zombies. I'm going to have to bring some aluminum back. Some aluminum pieces to repair this thing. There are quite a bit of birds up here. Part of me's thinking I'm gonna need more than just a little bit of time to clear that building. What all that we got going on over here? It's a good sized town. Oh shit. I don't think anything caught fire. But I'm gonna have to check. Oh shit. Shit. Oh yeah, some stuff caught fire. Oh, get out the car, stupid. I don't think I can get up there now. Fuck. Ah! My stairs. Oh, it was my st I never made my stairs. Okay, well, I don't see anything else burning. I should have made my stairs out of stone. I didn't even think about them blowing up like that. 
Stupid car. All right, let's go. That guy's nowhere near as deadly as one would imagine he would be. He should be. Alright, so that was a grenade launcher. Let's see. We're hitting hour 20. Pretty soon now. Did I just throw a grenade? No. He is the grenade. <laughs> Grab this stuff. I'm curious about that steeple. I want to go see what's in the steeple. I'm gonna put a bedroll down though. We'll probably do that. It's getting dark. I think. Uh... Oh my goodness! There's a. Is that a fairground? Oh yeah. Okay. Whoops. Come on. Open the door. Open the door. Open the thing up. All right. Go grab this vehicle. I wonder if I have the stuff to build stairs. I'll make sure I... Well, there's wood everywhere, so... Hello. It's so funny that you can pick the car up. That cracks me up. Okay, let's see. I mean, you don't need the stairs. I can jump just fine. Uh... Okay, we got another... We got one of those big zombies. We got this big building. It's definitely a church steeple. Oh, shit. Let's grab the stuff. We'll put a bed by that house. There we are. I might have to kill these guys first. And then we'll probably head back to the base. I think, I think I'm going to take... Well, if I put a bed down, I can honk the horn, kill all those nearby zombies, I think, and then collapse all of the stuff and take back everything that is a crafting item. And then we're going to take all of these items and break them down as appropriate. Excellent. Alright. Now bed. We need that and that. Let's put a bed right here. Because we are running out of time. We're hitting that point, ladies and gentlemen. This was a lot of good exploration. I really enjoyed this. But if I die over here, I want to be able to just revive. Now the key's going to be remembering to revive at the base. Now the base, remember the horde, we've got maxed out zombie numbers. So there's going to be all the zombies at the base. And it's going to be great. Okay, well, we'll do the fighting over here. So if we have to respawn, we're not right next to the respawn point. Oh, that's new. Holy shit. That almost killed me. Holy crap. That cold breath was new. <laughs> All right. Good stuff. Now, now that we got this whole area cleared out. Oh. Except for that guy, apparently. Hey, guy. You just uh, didn't want to fight with everybody else? I mean, I get it. I'm scary. I'm intimidating. Where'd 
Where'd you guys come from? Are you throwing a grenade? That zombie aim, it's just not what it used to be when he was on the course. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Zombies are all gone. Let's go... Get the motorcycle crafted. Oh. Apparently I've put all sorts of crap in here. Alright, well give me all of that. I know for sure the motorcycle stuff is in here now. Do I have the stuff to upgrade? I think I do. Do I have the stuff to upgrade these spikes? Repair. Upgrade. Yep. Oh, I can upgrade one of them. I need more nails to upgrade the rest. We definitely want to get those upgraded. Ooh, look at my food. Oh, shoot, the wave started. I guess we're done. All right, let's eat. Eat. Uh, oh, I don't have any meat stew, so we're not going to be eating that. Oh, and let's get power on. All right. And then I would like to switch out all of this stuff. All right, good enough for now. Um, I would like to have my assault rifle, please. And I would like to put the assault rifle on the crossbow slot. And I would like to grab my assault rifle ammunition, please. And number three, let's load it. My laser sight on, number four, let's load it. All right, let's grab a point in memory. And... Well, we're going to have the ballista on. We might as well, right? Now, can this charge? Is there a charge in that? Holy crap, this is a lot of zombies. Man, that was it. That was the charge. That's all it had in it. All right, how are we looking out here? Uh, are we still recording? Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right, they're not... Okay, they got past... They got to the... The, uh, what's a majingers up there? The guillotines. And then they died. Okay, he pushed, and he got to the first one. So if they're getting that far already... <laughs> it's gonna get nuts. Should have made some rocket launcher ammunition to throw down there. Okay. Alright, uh, let's see. Can I make some meat stew real quick? Because I don't like the fact that I don't have that in me. Um, let's make let's make two. I don't have any of the meat cut. I thought I could take the meat cut and disassemble it. Yeah, I thought the meat cut could be disassembled into standard meat, but I guess not? I'm not sure where... Oh, you know what? The... The animal thing never... It never harvested. I don't think. Because this one is supposed to do the skinning. Yeah, there's nothing in it. Which is weird. This one's got some, so I'll just take two out of here. We'll have to deal with that in the morning. Figure out why that's not skinning. Because that's not okay. Alright, let's get a couple of those done. Now we'll get that eaten. There we go. I don't know why I grabbed the guts. You don't need guts for that. Here, throw that in there. Alright. How are we looking over here? Only one guy so far has gotten up. I can deal with that. We've got a lot of zombies, though. Battery up there. 
can't see it from here. That sucks. That was bad placement. No. Oh, it did have it did have a charge in it. It did have a charge in it. Although it's it's kind of in a weird spot. Like I feel like I should have it against the where the spikes are you know like right next to that and that way it would it would be able to zap all those guys that are stuck on the spikes that'd be pretty sweet well how far out does it go does it hit those guys let's see Nah, i don't think it does i think i might move it i think i might move it and then i'll have to put up walls to funnel the zombies but yeah i think that might have to happen all right let's go take a look over here we're on max zombies, baby. And survival difficulty hit points. Whatever their hit points are for the default survival difficulty. Which I think is like half. The, bit, the halfway mark. Yeah, I'm not, I don't like that that panel right there. I think I'm going to change it. I'm not sure what to, but I'm definitely going to change it. Look at this guy. What the hell's he doing? Ooh. Ooh, we got some movement. We got some movement going. How far are they going to get? Oh, he's on there, and he fell off. I think he fell off because he was trying to get to me. He, he came to jump and it didn't turn out so well for him. Ooh, we got some more some more contenders. Oh, he didn't make it. Oh, I gotta keep an eye out for the for the giants. I don't know if tonight's a giant night, day eleven. I know day ten was a giant night, but I don't know what the formula is for when the giants show up. Oh, I think I took all the... Oh, no, I didn't. Look at that. It goes all the way down the line. Nothing's getting through with the flamethrower on. And the best part is, is it stuns them on whenever it hits them. It stuns them. See? Well, not whenever it hits them, I guess. It's not stunning those guys. So some of them it stuns. The only issue is, is when if they get past, then they start... Uh, making that thing change directions which then it could it could hit me so i'm not worried about the flamethrower right now they're not attacking it are they look at that guy on fire oh he's dead wow look at all these zombies there are so many you know what i should have done i should have done a spot where i could stand like where the flamethrower is and just shoot with the sniper rifle or whatever that would be pretty sweet A flamethrower would just be going all night long. Like, there would be no retrieve. It would just burn through fuel. Which I don't think we need. I don't think that's going to be an issue. Because those things are all still spinning. I mean, it's still hour zero, but... We've only had a couple of guys get through, and they didn't get far. They got over to that one. Yeah. They're just getting their butts kicked. Oh, it's quiet. Alright, let's make things interesting for a few minutes. Uh, I think we can probably pull this off, right? We'll just jump down. Zombies? Did you just hit my my floor? Where's stripper zombie going? Hey stripper zombie, I'm over here. Oh, there goes blow up zombie. He's like, oh yeah, traps are the way to go. Ow! That guy just threw a, a, a log at me. 
Oh, look, one of the spikes is gone. Oh, he's gonna blow. Oh, I'm on fire. So far, being down here isn't too bad. Because these are all low level zombies. These are like new, new river zombies. I wonder if. Oh! I wonder if there's any way to. I wonder if it's like they get harder. Oh, what is happening there? If they'll, um, what do you call it? If they'll bring like the snow zombies down or the, uh, the chest bursters, you know, stuff like that. That'd be pretty sweet. It'd be nuts, but it'd be sweet. Can you stop doing that? I'm right next to you. Ooh, he hit me. See, that's the only time that I'll get really messed up, is if they hit me like that and it stuns me long enough that um, I don't have time to defend myself. Whoa! He pulled me out of the fire. Yeah, like that. Alright, back up. Back up to the base. It was cool and all, but... Holy shit. Let's grab some of these. There we go. Pretty good damage. I mean, three shots, I took out one of those log guys. That's not bad. What is the damage of this thing? 135, and then I just do some upgrades on it. I don't know if I want to upgrade this one, because it's only blue and it doesn't have a boost to damage, but it's pretty sweet. And I think we're done. Definitely not getting any more giants, so let's flip that off. Yeah, I think we're done. What do I hear? I hear something malfunctioning. Hmm. Oh, never mind, it's my sword. Alright, uh, let's see. You are gonna need... Interesting that that count keeps going down. These ones don't. No, they do. Yeah, look at this one. I think... S oh, I don't have a battery on me. I'll go grab a battery and do some repairs. But overall, did pretty good. I like it. I mean, let's see. How far do we have bags up here? Let's see. We got a bag here. A couple of guys got to the first one. Ooh. Oh, yeah. We did get a couple of guys over here. I remember seeing at least one. Someone got to here. But I don't think anybody got any farther. Oh, well, these all say 99. Somebody got over here. Okay, those don't. Yeah, someone got to the end right here, because that's at 99. I'll go grab some sticks, go grab some batteries, do some refits, do some repairs. You can open that door, go get the rest of the bags. What are we at? Damn. Yeah, we got a few items. Nothing great. It's just a bunch of... Oh, does that say... No. A bunch of tier 2 junk. Just a bunch of garbage, really. But overall, pretty good. Damn good horde. I mean, come on, look at this. There's there's booty everywhere. I definitely like having more zombies. And I know that might bite me in the butt later. But for now, like, that was pretty sweet. This is still only at 98%. It's absolutely fine. It ran all night long, so it should be low on charge. But it's not, which is weird. But it may be later. Oh, we got a late bloomer. Someone that got stuck somewhere. That happens. Zombies get stuck places. I'm going to turn these all into metal as well. That'll be pretty sweet. We should have gotten a lot of, like, rubber and plastics, too. I think I put all of that stuff in my base already. These guys came over here, but they didn't really do any damage. There he is. And now we got... How much rubber and plastic did we pick up? Yeah, 54 and 42. That's great. See, that's the other good thing about maxing out the zombie numbers. The zombies drop rubber and plastic. And rubber and plastic is 
kind of important to this game. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I think that's going to go ahead and cut it. The horde's over. We did some interesting stuff, so I hope you guys did enjoy the episode. If you did, please do me a favor. Hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel for a little bit more content. Leave it. Whoops. Leave a comment in the comment section and share the video with your buddies because YouTube says sharing is caring. And as always, everyone, I do hope you have a great rest of your day. Shut up and sit down.